that down, could some San Diegans soon have to pay for trash pickup? Trash collection has been covered by the city for single family homes since an ordinance was created in 1919, but the city is now going to write a ballot measure that could change that. Fox 5's Clara Benitez joins us live from Miramar with the details here new at four. Clara. Well, Andrew, you are correct. Right now, single family homes do not have to pay for their trash to be collected in the city of San Diego. Now, this does not apply to condos, apartments, gated communities, or even people who live in private streets. They do have to pay. But now the city of San Diego is proposing a ballot measure to put that up to the people to vote. Now, it's called the People's Ordinance. Now, created a century ago, made it the city's responsibility to pick up trash for residents. An amendment in 1986 then banned apartments and condos, which is why some residents in San Diego do pay for trash collection, while others don't. In today's meeting, the city discussed preserving city jobs, allow for cost recovery, include cost of bins, and close loopholes that allows vacation rentals, additional units, and many dorms to exploit the free trash pickup. The San Diego Taxpayer Association says this is a complex issue, and we're in favor of adding the cost of trash pickup to everyone in 2015, but a lot has changed since then. Uh, there are new rules now on green waste and food waste. Uh, there are changes in the population. There are changes in what's going on in city finance. There's been changes, for instance, in uh, what happens in recycling. Um, and there's been a number of actually some global changes as well as some state changes that really necessitate us to do a deep dive into this and a deep dive into this issue and come up with a new potentially new position. Now again, today's meeting was essentially to have a motion to approve to even draft a proposed uh, ballot measure. So they will be doing that with the city attorney. If all goes to plan, voters and San Diegans could see this ballot um, in the November 2020-22 election. We're reporting live here from Miramar. Clara